This is Code.org. I'm working on CS Principles, Unit 5, Building Apps, Lesson 8, Boolean Expression and If Statements, Part 4. Explore comparison operators with council log. Comparison operators. So that's these things, right? Remember, equals equals is not setting up a variable. You're asking the computer, hey, are these two things equal, right? So if I do, so right here, age is 16. If I do age equals equals 16, that's going to return true or false. The computer is going to check the age variable, and if it does equal 16, true is returned, or false if age does not. If I do, oh, I should have only had two equal signs there, not three, two equal sign. If I do one, though, I'm reestablishing, I'm reassigning this variable. So it was 16, and well, it's 16 again, but it still re um defines the variable so your task make each expression evaluate to true by changing only the comparison operator and don't freak out by that that's these things that's a comparison operator right the greater than and equal to okay run the code provided result all right let's test this everything is false so age is greater than or equal to 18. we're only allowed to change the comparison operator well, 18, age equals 16. 16 is less than or equal to 18. Let's see. Clear this, I can't tell what's what. Okay, so we have a true. I'm gonna shrink all of this. And then age is less than or equal to, we'll say. First name, Marcus. Okay, so now we need to now we need to only change the comparison so only the symbols so first name well it's not marcus because marcus is capitalized here okay and not is this that's how you say is not equal to uh, the explanation point equal sign first name um that's is not as well true well true does equal true so you need two equal sign Boolean equals false. Boolean equals false. So we want to not here. Let's test those. Okay, we're getting there. Warning, below this line, examples get weird. Ah, this is a string. This is not a string. So these are not... There you are. But it will work. In JavaScript, it will compare an int to a string. Um, is greater than. This is stuff you should not do. JavaScript will compare. Use a comparison operator with an int and a string, right? So this is in quotes, so it's a string. Oh, what is this? So. And then this guy. Hello. False is going to be zero. Boolean, Boolean equals false. So let's try that. Let's see what this is getting us. This third one. Oh, not equals to. And then the last one, name. That's strange. I'm going to do not equals to. All right, let's see if we got it. True, 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 true. Yes. So here's what I got. Again, we use not equals a lot. Not equals, not equals. We use equality operator, which is equal to. And then we definitely wanted to use less than, greater than um, symbols as well. And we did not change any value on either side, just the symbol itself. Awesome. Let's keep going.